Cheerio, everybody. Can't you feel the love? Isn't this a wonderful week? I mean, if you don't count the cholera in Haiti, the horrible economy, and the political nonsense in Washington. Thank God for the Brits. Two important stories involving British subjects broke this week. The first was about the love between Prince William and his longtime girlfriend, Kate Middleton, which culminated in their engagement announcement earlier this week. What could be more exciting than a member of the largely irrelevant British royalty preparing to wed? We'll get to endure, I mean enjoy, hours and hours of video repeated over and over of royal carriages and previous bridal gowns. It will make Dancing with the Stars seem interesting. Much more important for the future of the world as we know it is the love between Apple and Apple. I mean Apple, the computer giant that owns iTunes, and Apple, the Beatles recording label. Because both groups have a love of money, Beatles tunes and albums are now finally available on iTunes. People are thrilled. Really? As of Wednesday, 10 of the top 20 albums on the iTunes chart were by the Beatles, and most of them were 40 years old. Old geezers like me already have most of the Beatles repertoire loaded into our iTunes from CDs we purchased long ago. But I still have a few items I need to add, so this news is great for me. It's also great for youngsters who don't know what CDs are, much less vinyl albums. They'll now be able to acquire some of the most important music in the history of the world in a format they understand. Okay, maybe that most important music in the history of the world was a bit over the top. But it's important news nonetheless. Meanwhile, in the interviews I've seen this week with the new royal couple, Kate doesn't seem to talk much. I wonder why. Majesty's a pretty nice girl, but she doesn't have a lot to say. My Majesty's a pretty nice girl, but she changes from day to day. I wanna tell her that I love her a lot, but I gotta get a belly full of wine. My Majesty's a pretty nice girl, someday I'm gonna make a mine, oh yeah. Someday I'm gonna make a mine.